Hey guys, it's Jules and this is Lupus Diaries. Today we're gonna do another update video because why not? <laughs> Alam niyo naman bida bida ako, so click your like subscribe button dyan sa baba. In my This Is Not An Inspirational video, if you haven't watched that yet, you can click the link up here, but be prepared to cry. <laughs> I mentioned in that video that soon I will have five doctors. And I met that fifth doctor last August 11. He's also an adult rheumatologist. Okay, backstory kasi, kakalipat ko lang sa adult rheumatologist last year. I was... 24 na. <laughs> Super adult. Kaso, medyo hindi ko feel yung una kong napuntahan na doctor. So, we tried another one na suggested din ng pedya ko. Uh, she was good but hindi siya accredited ng health card na meron ako. So, for financial reasons, I have to find another doctor who's accredited to my health card. Kasi syempre, mas maganda kung pasok lahat ng test ko and yung mismo finong doctor. So, we ended up going to a new doctor last August 11. Parang pangatlong adult rheumatologist ko na siya. Overall, it was an okay experience but medyo feeling ko parang siyang sales representative kasi right then and there, tinusukan niya ako ng dalawang vaccine, isang flu, isang lifetime ng mucocal. And then, binendahan niya rin ako ng isang box ng probiotic. Kailangan ko raw yung inumin as my medicine every day. One tablet a day for 30 days muna. Pero, parang required ko raw bilhin yung buong 100 pieces na box. So, parang, mm. Anyway, after that session, parang umabot ng 11,500 yung bill namin. Ng, di namin na-expect kasi yun nga, parang ang dami yung binigay. And then also, he gave a number of a sales representative na pwede na magbigay sa akin ng discount for my new medication. So yun, parang apat na items agad yun na binenta niya sa akin in our first meeting. Pero parang magaling naman siya as a doctor, like marami siyang alam. Pero yun nga, medyo nakakadalawang isip dahil sa ginawa niyang pagbenta ng sobrang daming stuff agad. Nang hindi pa niya kami kilala masyado. So anyway, I'm on new medication right now. If you wanna see yung previous medication ko, you can watch this video. May nadagdag ng mga bago ever since and one of them is called tacro Tacrolimus or Tacrolimus. Di ko alam kung anong tamang pronunciation. I haven't really researched much about it kasi I believe it's not yet widely known in the lupus community. So, wala pa masyadong research. Like, pag nag-search ka, as in, puro studies pa lang. One, because it's a relatively new drug nga, and it's hella expensive. <laughs> Isang pirasong 5mg tablet costs around 605 pesos, and I drink two na 5mg tablet so that's 1,200 pesos for the tacrolimus and then on top of that I still have my mycophenolate mofetil four tablets of that na tigo 120 so that's 480 on top of the 1,200 I recomputed all of my medication and pumapatong na ako sa around 1,900 to 2,000 pesos a day just for my medicine and my supplements. I just really hope this works kasi aalis kami sa end of September out of the country and ayoko magmanas doon or mag cramps kasi sayang naman, diba? <laughs> Minsan na nga lang mag out of the country. Of course, in the next few days, we'll also be fixing my diet. Ito na talaga, guys. I swear, magpapakabait ako to the best of my abilities. <laughs> like I said, napapagod na ako na konting kembot ko lang. Magkakamanas na ako or magkakakrams. Tapos, hihiga na ako buong araw. It's not a fun way to live. But it's what's necessary right now. So, that's what I'll do for the time being. Pakabait. Stay at home, bawala kwacha, kain mabuti, and healthy. It's time for a change. <laughs> kaya ko to, kaya natin to. Leave a like if you agree. Let's keep on fighting and don't forget to love you. See you in the next video.
By the way, this mean face is brought to you by 40 milligram prednisone. <laughs>